I'm here in the meadow by the red maple tree. Mama, hey mama, look sharp, here I be. Hey, hey, mama, look sharp. Them soldiers, they fired. Oh, ma, did we run? But then we turned round and the battle begun. Then I went under, oh ma, am I done? Hey, hey, mama, look sharp. My eyes are wide open, my face to the sky. Is that you I'm hearing in the tall grass nearby? Mama, come find me before I do die. Hey, hey, Mama, look sharp. Nothing to fear. It's a masterpiece. I'm to be congratulated. You? For making him write it. Oh, of course. It's a masterpiece, I say. They will cheer every word, every letter. I wish I felt that way. I believe I can put it better. Now then, attend, as friend to friend, our Declaration Committee. For us, I see immortality in Philadelphia City. A farmer, a lawyer, and a sage. A bit gouty in the leg. You know, it's quite bizarre to think that here we are, playing midwives too. An egg. Egg? What egg? America, the birth of a new nation. If only we could be sure of what kind of a bird it's going to be. Tom is the point. What sort of bird shall we choose as the symbol of our new America? The eagle. The dove. The turkey. The eagle. The dove. The eagle. The eagle. The turkey. The eagle is a majestic bird. The eagle is a scavenger, a thief, and a coward. A symbol of over 10 centuries of European mischief. The turkey. The turkey is a truly noble bird. Native American, source of sustenance of our original settlers. An incredibly brave fellow who will not flinch at attacking a regiment of Englishmen, single-handedly. Therefore, the national bird of America is going to be... The eagle. The eagle. We're waiting for the chirp, chirp chirp of an eaglet being born waiting for the chirp 
chirp, chirp on this humid Monday morning in this congressional incubator. God knows the temperature's hot enough to hatch a stone, let alone an egg. We're waiting for the scratch, scratch, scratch of that tiny little fellow waiting for the egg to hatch on this humid Monday morning in this congressional incubator. God knows the temperature's hot enough to hatch a stone, but will it hatch an egg? The declaration will be a triumph, I tell you, a triumph. If I was ever sure of anything, I'm sure of that. A triumph. And if it isn't, we've still got four days left to think of something else. The eagle's going to crack the shell of the egg that England laid. Yes, yes so we can tell, tell, tell on this humid Monday morning in this congressional incubator. And just as Tom here has written, Though the shell may belong to Great Britain, the eagle inside belongs to us. And just as Tom here has written, we say to hell with Great Britain, the eagle inside belongs to us. Feeling a bit tender toward our slaves. They don't keep slaves. Oh, no. But they're willing to be considerable carriers of slaves to others. They're willing. For the shilling. Or oh, haven't you heard, Mr. Adams? Clink, clink. Molasses to rum. To slurs. Oh, what a beautiful waltz. You dance with us, we dance with you in molasses and rum and slurs. Who oh, sail the ships out of Boston laden with Bibles and rum? Drinks a toast to the Ivory Coast. Hail Africa, the slavers have come. New England with Bibles and rum. And it's off with the rum and the Bibles. Take on the slaves, clink, clink. Then hail and farewell to the smell of the African coast. Molasses to rum to slaves. Tis not models, tis money that saves. Shall we dance to the sound of the profitable pound in molasses and rum and slaves? Who sail the ships out of Guinea laden with Bibles and slaves? Tis Boston can boast to the West Indies coast. Jamaica, we brung what she craves. Antigua, Barbados, we brung Bibles and slaves. Gentlemen, you mustn't think that our northern friends see our black slaves as merely figures in a ledger. Oh, no. They see them as figures on a block. Look at the faces at the auctions, gentlemen. White faces on African wharves, seafaring faces, New England faces, put them in the ships, cram them in the ships, stop them in the ships. Hurry, gentlemen, let the auction begin. <laughs> Gentlemen, you hear? That's the cry of the auctioneer. Slave, gentlemen, black gold, living gold, gold from a hundred. 
In the triangle trade, hail slavery, the New England dream. Mr. Adams, I give you a toast. Hail Boston, hail Charleston. Who stinker? The most. 